In goes Just Like Rosie, and now we're set. 900 the distance. Maiden class gallopers. No light. Starter hits the button there. Oh, Peggy Boom fast away from off the inside. Ruby Largo showing speed. Gilbert Skull just like Rosie. Sure to be went back to the rear. 700 to go. Peggy Boom has held them out. Shows the way by neck. Gilbert Skull pushes up in the centre. Ruby Largo three deep on the home corner. Two lengths of the back then to Just Like Rosie. Sure to be over on the inside. Last of all, down past the 450. Stanley's got a big grip on Peggy Boom. Shows the way by a half length. Gilbert Skull running second. Ruby Largo, the widest runner. Two lengths of the back to Just Like Rosie. Sure to be. They're coming down past the 200, though. It's Peggy Boom, the leader. Gilbert Skull still running second. Ruby Largo. Stanley shakes up Peggy Boom. Ruby Largo closing late with Gilbert Skull in the centre. Peggy Boom just in front, and Peggy Boom leads all of the way. Defeats Gilbert Skull. Ruby Largo had third. Fourth over the line, sure to be. And Just Like Rosie was the last one to clock in. Ladies and gentlemen, numbers after barrier trial number three, one, three, four, two, five. One Peggy Boom, the winner of the trial. She's a three-year-old brown filly by Spirit of Boom at a Pegasus Miss. Justin Stanley, the rider for Rockhampton trainer Clint Taylor. Second three, Gilbert Scold, four-year-old brown gelding by Altius at a Vitesse Rain. Brooke Johnson, the rider for Rockhampton trainer Pat Dillon. Third was four, Ruby Largo, a three-year-old chestnut filly by Rubik at a Here Shop. Olivia Donald, the rider for Rockhampton trainer John Wigington, fourth over the line that was too sure to be Colin Lennon for training partnership Michael and Christine Dorr of Rockhampton. Now the time for the trial was 53.7 for the last 600, 33.57 margins, a short neck by a half neck. And they are your details after heat three.